the pacey. They're pricey. They pack a punch. And they're all under 23. We've picked out the top 10 young talents of the Brazilian Rao. And for your enjoyment, here they are. Number 10. Underrated at San Paulo FC, Marcelino Mazzola is enjoying all the attention of Guarani. Pace is what the 21-year-old is all about. The tricky forward is all left foot. That doesn't stop him terrorising defences, as his five goals in the league testify. Number 9 After living in the shadow of the big names at Santos, Zé Eduardo is coming into his own and has left his mark four times in the championship after coming off the bench. While the 22-year-old's off-field antics have earned in the reputation of being the clown prince of the villa, no one can deny his finishing skills are above average for an offensive midfielder. Eight is Rafael Toloi. Goyas may be struggling in the league, but their commanding centre-back is having another great season. Toloi captained Brazil's under-20s to second place in Egypt in 2009. His concentration and the knack of making a timely interception has made the player one of the outstanding defensive prospects in the country. Add to this a delicate touch and Rafael Toloi more than justifies his place in the list. Number 7 is Danchino. Bruno Ferreira Bonfin, to give him his proper name, has scored 50 goals in just three years as a pro. And that's not a bad record for a 21-year-old striker. At 1m75, he's not the tallest of strikers, but he's clearly got the ability to sniff out goals for the Musketeers. Our sixth pick. At 1m87 and 84 kilos, the younger Damiao has an imposing presence inside the box. And has an impressive rate of eight goals in just 16 games. But the Inter striker really grabbed the headlines after scoring the turnaround goal against Chivas in the finals of the Libertadores. 40 meter run that proves the 21 year old is still very mobile despite his powerful figure. Moving on to fifth, we come to Jose da Silva. The 22 year old is another fresh face in the renewed Brazilian team under Mano Menezes. The Corinthians promise is fame for his marking abilities and his versatility. The 1.85 meter defensive midfielder can also be used in a more creative role or even out on the right flank. Throw in his ability to pick up goals and it's easy to see why he's rated so highly. The number four choice is just today's teammate Bruno Cesar. His fantastic performances with Mino Santo Andre not only earned him the Paulista League Rookie of the Year award, but he also caught the eye of Corinthians. Since his arrival at the Parque San Giorgi, the number 10 has been an absolute revelation. With nine goals to his name, the midfielder is joint leader in the chase for the cover of the Golden Boot. The 21-year-old seems to have it all, as well as his obvious eye for goal. Bruno is deadly from set pieces. And 
is the ideal man to pull the strings in the middle. With talent like this, the young musketeer is a near certainty for Brazil. Three. Tenacity. Close control. And the ability to escape his markers. That's a trademark of Internationale's Juliana de Paula. Skills like these have turned the 20-year-old into one of the hottest properties in Brazil. Playmaker's instinct to pop up at the right place at the right time were vital in the Res Libertadores winning campaign, where Juliano finished as his team's top scorer with five goals. At number two, it's no exaggeration to say that no other young midfielder in the world understands the game of football as much as Paolo and Hikinima. At only 20, Ganso is already a real maestro who uses his amazing ability with great intelligence. Goals in 2010 were instrumental in Santos's wins in the Paulista League and the Copa de Brazil. His silky skills, eye for the killer pass, Outstanding technique, being that his price tag is around the 50 million euro mark. Now a full international, Paolo and Hiki can only get better. Too bad we'll have to wait until 2011 to see him back in action, as an knee injury has ended his season. Our number one choice would have to be Neymar da Silva Santos Jr. Destined for greatness from an early age. Santos Ford has not disappointed. A goal on his debut for Brazil was just another step on the way to world superstarting. At only 18, Neymar already has everything a top striker needs. Pace. Dribbling skills. And perfect execution. And if that wasn't enough, he's also got that extra something special that could turn him into one of the planet's best footballers. With five goals in the league, the number 11 is in the fight to become the youngest top striker in the history of the Brazilian round. That's our look at the top 10 young talents in Brazil. But many more are certain to emerge soon, and you can be sure that you'll see them here first on Foot Brazil.